from New York, it's theCUBE, covering Blockchain Week. Now, here's John Furrier. Hello everyone, I'm John Furrier, the co-founder and co-host of theCUBE. We're here in New York City for exclusive coverage of Blockchain Week New York. Put on a variety of events, one is Consensus 2018, sold out, packed house as well as another event, Crypto House, here in East Village for a great event. I'm here with Patty Perez, who's the owner of the Crypto House, used to live here. Hey, thanks for having us today, and I want to, what's the story? You own this place, it's now a great venue for inspiring a lot of entrepreneurs who couldn't have an outlet to have their voice heard. Well, originally this was my yoga school. It was a live work house for 10 years, and I closed it seven years ago and just lived here and um and now i'm ready for my next venue and i was telling my boyfriend that you know i really want to do something with my house sort of like the yoga school but i'm so excited and interested in blockchain for the last year and and wouldn't it be great to have a social club or an education hub for this because i have no idea what's going on and i want to learn and so why not have all the thought leaders come to my house and, and teach each other and just open it up to all of us because I know you're learning every day. Yeah. I know I am. It's fantastic and, and influencers, they learn all the time and, and that's why they make some influencers. But I think what's important here that I wanna just share and it's a great story and I think you, you really deserve a lot of credit for it is that it's a venue for people to not only learn and share their experiences, but it's also an outlet for some collaboration in the open in a way that's uh, community-based. It's not like a structured event, big tent event, sponsors everywhere, you know, make money. This is about people in the community having access. And so I gotta ask you, when did this happen? Like just, because I love this place. Well, we, we've been co-conspiring it and, and I've been uh, speaking with Strategic Coin like, come on, let's do this, let's do this at my house. And they're so busy with you know, a million projects. And, um, but somehow the waters parted and here we are and we got a great team together and Strategic Coin has been just amazing. And well, I gotta tell you, I lived in California last week, I was in San Francisco for some events, Red Hat Summit, big open source community. Of course, we watched the Twitter sphere and the you know, Snapchat fears, Instagram, Facebooks of the world, all that place. You guys had great buzz over the weekend and even coming in uh, yesterday uh, and today, a lot of great community conversations, not just people promoting their, their, uh, their event at like consensus, hey, come to our booth. There's just authentic knowledge being shared on the, on the digital sphere. And that, that work, that connects with people, so congratulations. There's a great need, obviously, above and beyond uh, us or anyone. It's, it's, it's so organic. And today, yesterday, there were a series of speakers, and they were all amazing and interesting. But today, the conference took on what we coined as the unconference. And sure enough, it was more of a boxing ring <laughs> than a conference yeah. of debating and just sort of being in that vulnerable place of actually not knowing something and being in the inquiry in that uncomfortable space and people felt so comfortable to take deep dives into what they're actually wanting to create or, you know, so it's... That's great progress too when you have a debate and not have to worry about being judged. Do exactly. It in a learning exercise. And you don't have to, you know, look a certain way or have your, you know, everyone was really like, you know what? And you don't know what you're talking about. It's like, wait a minute. And Sounds it was like just, my Facebook feed. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what did you learn this week? What was the big surprise for you? What was a, a cool thing you've learned? Can you share an anecdote, anecdote so far from this week? Wow, that's a good question. And I have to respond right at this moment. Um, well, the, gre the greatest thing that I learned is how much people need education around this you know it, not just businesses but everyone because it ignites I think so and also one thing that I've noticed more than anything else is that there is an interculturation between the old bankers and the new kids that are really and the old bankers are saying well you kids are idiots there is an interculturation between the old bankers 
and the new kids that are really, and the old bankers are saying, well, you kids are idiots. ...like this in a way that can be contentious, pending sometimes if you, on the other side of the debate, <laughs> but it's floating in the digital sphere. So, you know, we believe at the Cube, we've seen it with content, good content, authentic, genuine content, co-developed, creates community karma. Yes. And you're doing that here. I think so. And also one thing that I've noticed more than anything else is that there is an interculturation between the old bankers and the new kids that are really, and the old bankers are saying, well, you kids are idiots. And the new kids Get are like, my oh lawn. my God. Yeah. And so it's so much fun just meeting in the middle and it's a whole new culture that's being created. Well, I was having a conversation with Richard from Arcadia Crypto uh, Partners and I was, and there needs to be some mentoring because this is an opportunity for both. I mean, I know some of the smartest guys in crypto are old, are old dogs and gals, they're out there, but the young guns have the energy and the ideas as well. So I see a mix and I think it's important that uh, the older generation, if you will, that's <laughs> something talk about me myself, but you know, really kind of let the young kids in. And, and there's a young that, kid in you that yeah, is yeah. so excited right I now. I, I see it in something. your eyes. Well, you 20. are. You're it's the most exciting wave. I've been involved Absolutely. in a lot of waves of innovation. This one, by far, is the best. I see it's, the inner teenager right now. Okay, we're bonding here <laughs> on, the, on the cube. Patty, thanks so much for doing what you do. And Crypto House is an amazing initiative and project. Very strong mission. Love the mission, and I love to promote it. Thanks for having us on the cube. Thank thanks for having us so the much. Set. We appreciate Thank it. you. I'm John Furrier here at the Crypto House for the Block event, but it have been events all week as part of Blockchain Week, New York. Of course, the cube is there covering it as usual. Thanks for watching. See you next time.